Warning, the following show features stunts performed either by professionals or under the supervision of professionals. Accordingly, the reality guys and producers must insist that none of these opinions be taken as facts. Now, please enjoy the show. Welcome back to the reality guys. I'm your host, Billy Blinks, joined as always by my co-host, Brian. Hello. We are excited to do one of our favorite things we do here on the reality guys. That's a season preview slash cast preview for one of our favorite shows franchises that we got into last year. We are talking Love Island. We're talking the original OG UK series. It's coming back uh, January 16th on ITV or however you get your content. We're going to go on to a, we have a cosmopolitan.com preview. We have not looked at this before. Uh, we are just going to read the cast members' names, their quick little bios. You know, not really going to have like a prediction on like winners. We can try to blind predict winners, whatever, but like we're more so just going to react to the cast and just excited like all of you to have Love Island back in our lives. Uh, we will figure out our content schedule. Obviously, we cover a lot of other shows, so even if they may be quick. Uh, hit videos and maybe some of them if they are kind of more dramatic episodes will have longer reviews uh, also check out our TikTok account we had put a lot of things like that out there as well uh, so I'm going to share the preview Brian and we will get going hell yeah it's going to be tough to make a prediction with Casa Amor we don't even know who's coming there so many people so we're not going to watch the trailer uh, obviously you guys can find that pretty easily um, first person Harris Namani, 21, from Doncaster. He's a TV sales, a TV salesman. Oh. <laughs> what year what is you, it? <laughs> what do you think you'll bring to the villa? I'll bring a, I'll bring a TV. Yeah. I'm different. I'm a unique guy. The way I act, confident, not awkward, especially with the girls. I'm friendly. I'm very respectful as well. Anyone who meets me, I don't think anything bad to say about me. I don't give them a bad impression. Say, oh, I don't want to speak to him again. The accents we're not getting like this is the thing about this being the European or the UK one. The accents I can't are gonna, wait. I can't wait to hear these people. And I'm sure we're having a lot of people right now watching us in the UK and they're laughing at us with our yeah. That's fine. That's fine. You can. I, that's, we love, we don't care. I love being laughed at. Uh, Olivia Hawkins, 27 from Brighton. Uh, she's a ring girl and actress. Okay. Her claim to fame is I did a film with Jason Statham had a ten nice ten minute convo about life. Been a ring girl for KSI. I played a waitress in James Bond with. Da oh, all okay. right. Wow. Daniel Craig. I've also been a body double for Michelle Keegan and Emma Watson. Hey, why is she on the show? Dude, I'll take that. I mean, yeah. We'll tell. All right. Shaq Muhammad, 24 from London, <laughs> airport security officer, Love Island. And why now? I haven't had the best luck with pro oh boy previous relationships. So I thought, why not in the sun and potentially meet the love of <laughs> Yeah, right. But hopefully I do come out with my future wife, the person I hope to marry one day. Hopefully she's in the villa. I don't believe you. <laughs> I don't believe you. I do. I do like his bathing suit. Yeah. I was just going to say, that's those are sick trunks. Uh, okay. We got Tanya Revan or Raven. 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 I don't know what we're going to go with. Uh, age 26 okay. from North London hairstylist. Her celebrity crush is Channing Tatum. I do like pretty boys. They give me the ick because they always have a crap personality. Channing Tatum's handsome, but not too pretty. He's manly and he can dance. If a man can dance, I'm in love with him straight away. Seems like a scattered thought. So she likes Magic Mike. <laughs> we got Will Young. All right, normal dude. Seems like vibe. 23 from Buckinghamshire. Oh, I did good on that one. He's a farmer. Wow. Tell us something. Every night I light a candle and meditate for 20 to 25 minutes. A girl I was seeing told me to meditate. I tried it and loved it. I stopped seeing her and carried on meditating. So I made <laughs> self reflect, taking a minute on my day and week. It's really nice. It sets me up for a nice sleep. Hey, Will. I like Will. That was a funny, that was a funny quote. And then I, yeah. I stopped seeing her, but like I still I carried on the tradition. Uh, Anna Mae Roby, 20 from Swansea. She's a payroll administrator. Uh, how would your friends and family describe you? Energetic. I'm always running around singing and screaming. My parents are always like, shut up. I work from home all day and I don't really speak to people in person for two or three days a week. So when my father comes home, he'll want to sit down and chill out. I'm there chewing his ear off. I would definitely say I'm a chatterbox. That's definitely annoying. We'll see. She's only 20, though. What? She's only 20. I mean, it's really not that big. Yeah. It's got, yeah. Ron Hall from 25 from Essex. He's a financial advisor. Tell us something many people would not know about you. On meeting me, you never know. I'm oh, here's the guy. 
Blind okay. in one eye. It was over a football injury when I was eight. I went for a header and I got kicked in the face. Oh. Two different colored eyes, one blue, one green, adding like character. There's so many more people that are worse off than me. If anything, losing something makes you realize that it's not a hindered me in relationship. Yeah, you're still handsome and you're not blind. Like that's why. Yeah. Which what eye do you think it is? Left or right? If you had to guess. <laughs> I can't I I can't I'm like, I don't want to say it's his left. I think the left's the fake one. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> can't wait to find out. Hit in the face. I'd rock a patch. Oh, yeah. Uh, Kai Fagan, 24 from Manchester, science and a gym teacher. Why would you say you're single? I'm single by choice. I'm looking for the right girl. I don't have quite. I I have quite high expectations. I don't feel I should commit to someone unless I'm absolutely buzzing over them because it's not fair on them. Okay, Kai. 24. Lana Jenkins, 25 from Lutton. She's a makeup artist. What's her claim to fame? In my work as a makeup artist, I also work with a lot of celebrities. Also, when I was six, I used to live in Spain and I was an extra, an episode of Benidorm as an extra. That must be some like Spanish, like soap opera or something. <laughs> Tanya Manhega, 22 from Liverpool, a student of biomedical science and an influencer. What gives you the ick? Guys that don't wear socks in the house. Why are your feet flapping all around the house? <laughs> guys have huge feet too. Yuck. Also, guys in bed on their bubbles. Such an ick. No. It's funny. That's my favorite bio. So Do you wear socks in your house? Yeah, I'm wearing socks right now. Yeah, I always wear socks. I looked down. I was like, yeah. Yeah, I, I can, can confirm. Uh Oh, I like this rumored Love Island. Chloe Nicole. Another rumored Islander viral treat alongside a series of photos. 23 year old Chloe. She's always in Love Island crew. In fact, her BFF is India Pollock from the 2022 series. Oh, 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 oh. Brad McDermott. He's Zara McDermott's younger brother. According to the Sun, he's a young, good looking guy. He's seen appearing in Love Island, has completely transformed Zara's life. That she didn't find long term love, it has served to create platform first. So it's like a yeah. so it's like a referral system. Nepotism. Oh yeah. Chloe Baker. So two Chloe's. Model and influencer. Chloe worked with brands like Pretty Little Thing, Missy Empire, Lipsy Associate Influencer. Okay. I'm like excited. I'm excited to hear their voices. There's gonna be so many more, obviously, that come, but that will be probably who we see over like over the first like few weeks. Like I said, as far as our coverage. Um, whether there are videos, stuff on our social media, TikTok, especially if we don't have a YouTube video, we'll throw a TikTok review out there. Uh, so check out both. But said, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and you'll catch any Love Island. And like I said, reality January, you'll be if you watch any other kind of reality TV show, we're probably going to give it a look at a coverage. And uh, I think you'll enjoy the content. So for myself and Brian, thank you. Peace. See you at the villa. Casemore.